Today, we're going to be moving into the design phase of publishing a book. For many indie authors, uh, besides actually writing the book, the design phase is a favorite part, and I share that sentiment. Book design consists of two major areas, book formatting, so the interior design of the book, and cover design. I suggest as an indie author that you do your own interior formatting, and the software that I recommend you use is called Vellum. On the other hand, I don't suggest that you design your own cover. Now, the pre-made covers can be excellent if you're on a budget. There are adequate templates out there in software like Canva. However, if you have to pick and choose where you're going to invest uh, your marketing budget, hiring a top-notch cover designer is really one of the best investments you're going to make. I'm going to do a couple of videos dedicated entirely to cover design, but today we're going to be talking about formatting your interior of your book using Vellum. Now, Vellum costs about $250, and that's a one-time purchase fee. That might sound a little steep to you, but it is incredibly worth it. The software is so easy to use, and really one of the major benefits of using Vellum is that you can um, revise. I don't know if you're like me. I bet many of you are, but as you go through the process of uh, creating advanced reader copies and galleys and you know getting reviews, getting endorsements over a period of months leading up to the release of your book, there's, there's changes you're going to want to make, uh, perhaps even extensive changes. All right, well, enough of that preamble. Let's go to the demo. Okay, so before you even start formatting in Vellum, you want to have your manuscript in really good shape. Uh, I use Google Docs, uh, but if you're in Word or Scrivener, what you need to start with is a manuscript that has the chapters separated out. Once you have your manuscript in shape, You've exported it to your manuscript folder in the cloud. You import the document into Vellum. Uh, you'll have to uh, export uh, your Scrivener, your Google Docs, or Pages into Word format. Of course, Word will format it in Word. Uh, but you'll need to uh, create a Word file for Vellum to be able to import it. So you select import word file, you select your file, and there you go. It imported the manuscript into almost a perfectly formatted book. Uh, so you're going to need to clean up things. However, as you see here, it is really almost ready to go. Um, you can select different styles for the book. So you select this curly Q icon here, and we have um, various templates for different styles of books. So depending on the genre, you know, romance, young adult, literary fiction, um, you know, contemporary, and I actually like just the basic uh, default, which is Meridian. You go back into your uh, document here, and as you see, the chapters are imported, the parts are imported. You can create new parts by selecting several chapters and clicking the gear here 
and you can say create part from section. All right, so that indented it more. You can outdent it. You can remove that because I didn't actually need a part from that section, but you can create additional parts. Now, my book had the front and back matter uh, already included. However, if you don't have your front and back matter included, you can add elements, okay? And I will make a video about uh, all of the potential front and back matter you can include in your book. However, if you purchase vellum, you will know exactly what the industry standard is for uh, the order of the elements. So typically your endorsements and blurbs go first. You get your half title, your title page, copyright, dedication. I can't believe how amazingly easy uh, this is once you have purchased the software. So if you use the social media template down here in the Kindle book, those will appear as icon links. So people can just click on those. Um, you don't have to worry about facing pages, what should be blank, etc. The software has that all programmed in. The other excellent thing about Vellum is, as you're moving through creating advanced reader copies, galleys, you're going through the review process prior to publication, you really may want to have a, quite a few changes. And if you are in control of this document, you can make as many changes as you want extensive changes even. Uh, I changed a character's name in my book from Linda to Lydia. I just thought Lydia suited the character better. So I could do a find and replace for her name. Now, if you're working with a book formatter and you make these decisions over a period of several months leading up to your release, they're going to get pretty irritated. <laughs> they don't want to do more than a, a two or three passes. So um, I, I have experienced having to go back and forth with a formatter and Vellum is far superior. And as I said, the end result is indistinguishable from a professional formatter. Uh, okay, so um, I can show you how you can paste something in, right? So... Take his section and put it in there, right? Okay. Title, author name, you can add contributors. Okay. Import the cover image for the Kindle. And then you can then you can generate the ebook and the print book. For our demonstration, I'm going to put it in a different folder just so I don't get things mixed up. So I'm going to choose that and generate the Kindle version and the print version. And you can see the files here. It's as easy as that. Ready to upload to Amazon or Ingram Spark or the printer of your choice. You have the correct margin and standard formatting. You go back to the folders here. We have the EPUB also ready for upload to whatever bookseller you wish. And again, 
And again, reflowable text in the EPUB format. So that will work on any Kindle reader or tablet or phone or device. So, I hope you agree with me. It's worth every penny. Okay, that's it. It took less than 10 minutes to completely format a ebook and a print book. The files are ready for upload to your bookseller or POD company of your choice. And it's as easy as that. Um, again, uh, I am blown away by how excellent the Vellum software is. They're not sponsoring this video. My glowing review comes purely from my heart. Uh, so I do highly suggest that you invest in that software and take the little bit of time it takes to learn how to create beautiful book designs. All right, that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next video.